Hallelujah, hallelujah. Praise the name of the living God. The Bible says in the book of Isaiah chapter 3 verses 10, that tell the righteous it shall be well with them, for they shall enjoy the fruit of their labor. And it doesn't matter what you are going through right now. I just want to let you know that you shall enjoy the fruit of your labor. As you build your house, you will live inside your house. As you prepare and make your bed, you shall lie on your bed. As you plant your crops, you will harvest very well and you will be thankful and you will enjoy the fruit of your labor. Many are the times that people labor in vain. Many are the times that people construct houses and they have no, no chance to live in them. They die just at, at the conclusion of the construction. Many are the times that people have, people plant their crops in their gardens and they have have no chance to harvest them. Other people harvest on their behalf. Many are the times that we do a lot of things and other people enjoy on our behalf. But today I want to declare to somebody who is believing together with me, you shall enjoy the fruit of your labor. As you do labor, you shall not labor in vain. In Jesus' mighty name, everything that you are doing, nobody will enjoy them on your behalf. You shall enjoy whatever you have labor but for you will be you will be happy to enjoy your sweat in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I declare and decree let the spirit of laboring in vain be defeated in Jesus' mighty name. You shall not labor in vain for other people to come and enjoy. I declare to you that you shall enjoy the fruit of your labor and you will enjoy your sweat in Jesus' mighty name. As you build your house, you will live in your houses. As you do businesses, you will enjoy the money, the profit, the outcome of your businesses. No one will enjoy on your behalf. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, may the Lord be with you and let that word be yours in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. God bless you.